What is up, it's your boy Gwinner coming at y'all with another reaction, but we put a hop in episode number six of volume five of Ruby. And uh yeah, let's get it. Shit, I have no idea who this is. Oh, it is Crow. I was gonna say Crow, but I was like, I don't know. Doesn't look, look like a bar. I'm actually looking for someone. Goes by the name Shiro Wan. Ever heard of him? I heard he's a regular around here. Who's asking? Hey, I'm not some cop, if that's what you mean. I need Shiro for a gig. Cop. We go way back. Way back, huh? So, he's a friend of yours. Hmm, yeah, I'd say so. He's a pretty all right guy. Well, in that case... You tell that jerk that he better not show his ugly face in here until he pays me the lien he owes me! Uh, well, goddamn. Uh, I, uh, <laughs> I meant acquaintance. <laughs> he's like, oh, I don't know him like that now. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, uh, thanks for your time, buddy. Uh, I'll just be taking off now. What the fuck? <laughs> yeah, I may have to take a drink after that. That's funny. So, can't get Shiro. So, he's trying to put together the team right now. God damn. Struggling. <laughs> oh shit. He can't find none of these people. Heather Shields. Oh, uh, uh, hey there. Uh, I'm looking for Heather. Look, mm -hmm. pal, I've had a rough day. Do you know where she is or not? Daddy? Does he know where Mommy is? Damn, they don't even know where she is. I, uh, Fuck. I'm sorry to bother you. Mm -mm -mm. Damn, he couldn't find none of them. He already marked out all of his damn contacts. Mm. Damn, so all of them are on missions. Shit. This man really struggling to put that to put together a team. Mm-mm. Oh, he went back to this place. You got a lot of nerve showing up back here, unless you brought that idiot with you. How much did Shiro owe you? Well, I'd say about 16,000 Lian. 16,000? Wait, what? Man, you must be in some serious trouble with him if you're paying me off. His name is clear. Mm. Yeah. Thanks. So I'm guessing we definitely gonna get to see the Shiro person eventually. That idiot. Mm. 
No fondness. Yeah. Mm -mm -mm. No, this is going to be an interesting conversation. You can wait outside. Thank you. So, what's the truth? You know, it's better when it's hot. You know, you're really obnoxious. Mm. The truth is that truth is hard to come by. A story of victory for one person is a story of defeat for someone else. By now, your uncle has surely told Ruby and her friends plenty of stories. Well, he's never given me a reason to doubt him before. That doesn't mean those reasons don't exist. You know, you and your teammates might as well be the poster children for the Huntsman Academies. Your motives vary, but you all enrolled to try and make the world a better place. It's adorable. It's what Huntsmen and Huntresses do. Mm. Not all of them. Oh, Some clearly. Some people are just in it for the money and the fame, but there's even more that are just looking to grow stronger. Your Uncle Crow and I didn't attend Beacon to become Huntsmen. We did it to learn how to kill Huntsmen. What? Daddy and Uncle left that oh, part shit. out. Oh, hmm? shit. Aside from the Grim, Huntsmen were the only ones capable of ruining our raids and hunting us down. Our tribe needed a counterforce. And Crow and I were the perfect age. The entrance exams hmm. were child's play compared to what we'd already been through. We were good. So good that we caught the attention of Beacon's very own headmaster. Ospen? Professor Ospen. Damn. Even after we were put on a team, I could tell he was keeping his eye on us. Back then, I thought it was because he knew. But it was Team Stark he was interested in. Team Stark? What do you mean by that? Constant attention, extra training missions, turning a blind eye whenever we happened to break the rules and get into more trouble than we should have. So like Sound Team familiar? Ruby. Mm -mm -mm. What's your point? How much do you know about Professor Ospin? About his past? He was a prodigy. One of the youngest headmasters to be appointed to a school. Because that's how he planned it. Because the man you know as Ospin designed those schools and has followers inside every academy on Remnant that are loyal to him and no one else. That doesn't make any sense. How could he have... No, why would someone even do that? Because old man Oz has a great and terrible secret. One that could spread fear across the world. One that he eventually entrusted to our team. And once I knew, there was no so going back. So, she's gonna tell him about how he can reincarnate and shit. But with every new discovery I made, the more horrifying the world became. Okay, then tell us. What's the big secret? What's so crazy that the rest of us don't know? The creatures of Grimm have a master named Salem. She can't be stopped. She can't be reasoned with. And she will not rest until humanity crumbles at her feet. What? Mm. You know you two haven't even touched your tea. Why should we believe any of this? Now you're catching on. So far, you've done nothing but accept what others tell you. But you need to question everything. Oh, wow, she's actually... Oh, now nah, they're about the same height. I was about to say maybe she's a little taller, but they're about the Otherwise same height. you'll end up just as blind as Crow. And your fool of a father. Ah, oh, fuck. Don't you dare talk about my family like that! You need to calm down. Yang, please! Listen to your friend, Yang. Your teammates never let you down before. You don't know the first thing about my teammates! About me! You were never there! You left us! Why? Uh -huh. I know more than you realize. Not just about you, and not just what I've been told, but things I've seen with my own eyes. I know the Grim have a leader. I know people who can come back from the dead. 
I know that magic is real. And I can prove it. Oh shit. Is she only I don't think she's just talking about Ozpin. I told you all about my semblance. Well, I doubt he ever told you, but Oz did to my brother and me. Ah, shit. Go see for yourself. Mom? Yang. Are you okay? I'll be fine once we could get her to take us to Ruby. It's okay if you're not okay. You didn't mm -hmm. believe what she said, right? I, I mean, she actually did say of course she'd not. tell the truth. Well, not all of it. It was crazy. We have dust, semblances, but I mean, there's no such thing as magic. A raven? I've seen that bird before. Maybe it belongs to your mom? Okay, so she could turn into that. So I'm guessing they've How never seen anything like that before. Her and Crow can do well, that. I could explain it to you. Or you could ask your uncle. Hmm. You're letting us go? And just like that, she's gonna let choice. them go. Stay here with me, and I'll answer all of your questions and more. We can have a fresh start. Or you can go back to Crow and join Ozpin's impossible war against Salem. And meet the same fate as so many others. But can you really go back to trusting someone that's kept so much from you? Mm. Nah, she gonna go. All I care about is making sure my sister is safe. Yeah, she did them. Okay. Yeah. If you side with your uncle, I may not be as kind the next time we meet. You aren't kind this time either. Mm. I know. This isn't right. I get one or two of them, but all of them? <sighs> Raven? Oh. Hmm. Hey, two, Team Ruby's slowly getting back together. Now all they need is Blake. Ow. All right, the first patch is just about done. Now we just need Crow and we'll be all set. Do you really think he's going to bring that many people? This is a lot of food. Uh, I don't know. But it sounds like we can use all the help we can get. Damn. So it was for those two showing up. Right he would have showed up with absolutely nobody. <laughs> no, I'm God damn. Up. Hey, uh, Ruby. I'm coming! Bruh. Fine, you take over. People were coming, so we just cooked all of it. <gasps> the end, you're breaking shit. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, it's the first time I've seen each other since volume three, bro. Dang, I, I'm so God sorry. I damn, know, I should have stayed and I should have talked to you more. I, I just I, I wasn't sure if you wanted me around it. Mm -mm -mm. I love you. I love you too. 
Mm-mm-mm. When Blake gonna show up? We need to get the whole team together back. We gotta get them all back together. Oh, that's an episode. Yeah, sorry if I was like super quiet this episode. It seemed, there was like a lot of talking, so I, for the most part, I was just listening this entire episode. So sorry if I was like mad quiet, but hey, we finally got Team Ruby all back together. Well, not all of them. We still need to wait for Blake. God damn, I wonder if she's gonna show up. As, I feel like she's got her own little thing going on with the White Fangs. I feel like it'll probably be a minute before she's back too. But anyway, if y'all enjoyed the reaction, please feel free to leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.